Uh, game duration 145, enemy strength brutal, sandbox is on, and we'll do radioactive desert. And start it. I suggest start with tier two rockets. Tier two rockets? Um, I don't know. I've had so many times that they get up on, on the spot on the cliff and like rockets don't have line of sight of them, but they, like they can hit down, but we can't hit up. Rift jump successful. Sensors online, weapons activated. We're ready to go. Okay. This biome is much less welcoming than the tropical zone. It's full of radiation and there's practically no wind here. We'll have to rely on solar power, at least in the beginning. Ashley, remember to watch out for quicksand. You'll have to place extra stable floor over it to prevent our buildings What makes the snails so dangerous? They can hit you from many, many screens away. And their attack, uh, it, imagine, it, like, it shoots an artillery shell. And that artillery shell is an egg that spawns a bunch of monsters. So, and it, they can outrange all your defenses. Neither the tier one sub to meteor panic. They have given five hundred and thirty-eight gifts. So if left unchecked, they will kill everything. The channel. Like they will one hundred percent kill everything if left unchecked. Ashley, I'm sure that our presence will not go unnoticed. We should build up our base as Standard protocol advises to set up walls and sentinel towers around the base. We aren't sure what to expect. Is basically like Broodlord for Sargo 2 on series. Uh, steroids, yes. Accurate. Not enough carbonium. Not enough carbonium. Snail buches <laughs> instead of trebuchet. Did Siege Tank plus Rulo, yeah. Also, it has a decent amount of health. It's not fragile. And if you get close to it, it has a melee attack that can pop you in one hip. And also, they explode when they die. So if you're in melee range when it dies, uh, you can get killed by that. Note the meteor shower on the first attack. I will try to... Well, I always say that you guys could do mutiny after the first attack. So we'll... Let's we'll see what happens. Oh, we found a cobalt early. storage is full. Build more storage facilities. more power. One thing I've always turned out was whether flame or acid sphere towers are better in the desert. Uh, I would say electric. <laughs> I feel like flame... Flame spitter. No, th th this could be wrong. This is my opinion. I feel like the flamethrower tower, the acid spitter tower, the electric uh, tower, the lightning tower, and also the earthquake tower all do the same job. But unless they're immune to lightning, I feel like the lightning tower is just way better than all the others because of its absurd range. Like the shockwave tower will get killed by stuff before they even get in range of it almost every time I use it. Lightning Tower is the one that chained the enemies in the back. Yes. Some buildings don't have enough power. Yep. Not enough carbonium. Not enough carbonium. Not 
Not enough carbonium. Ironium storage is full. Build more storage facilities. Yeah, working on it. Need the sun to come up. Not enough carbonium. In the acid biome, I default to fire everywhere. Uh, fire does work well there. That's kind of like how I default to hammers when I go to the Crystal Cavern. Detecting a large group of creatures heading towards our position. It looks like our presence is being noticed. We have to assume we're not welcome here. Remember to use repair kits if necessary. I wonder if the game is smart enough. Like, if I'm making this tile and I do it like right here, will it only take? Well, like, well, if I do, if I click this, will it take less? than when I click this. I wonder if it actually maths that out. Oh, I still haven't made an armory. Oh no, that's not good. Let's do that now. I hate dust storms. What? Community voted dust storm. All right, F5. All right, what was the guy? He wanted a, a meteor. Okay. Meteor shower. Evasive maneuvers, Mr. Riggs. I usually don't do this with the first attack, but you know, I spoil you. I also usually have a laser sword by now. This dust storm is actually pretty bad. I can't see the enemies well. I cannot, dude. The dust storm plus the meteors. Oh my god. Storage is full. Build more storage facilities. One of our energy connectors has been destroyed. A meteor shower is damaging our base. Dude, the worst part right now is the goddamn visibility. It looks like the dust storm is over. Oh my god. The rock rain is over. I didn't see. That was intense. Alright, so we lost one mining outpost from that. It should only take the resources for the tiles that need it. Would be good if so. Most of the time this game is like 100% efficient. Like the mines won't mine if your uh, income is full. Wait, Jinxie, wake up. I think Jinxie fell asleep on the keyboard. I tried to delete it, but my, yes. That was a very important mod message from either Jinxie's face or Jinxie's cat. Not sure which one. Was there their account gotten hijacked or something? If so, I doubt they would have typed dots. Drawson E gifted a tier one sub to Jinxie Myelinia. 
They have given 370 gift subs in the channel. Turn Chad, if you'd like to impact the game, you have a chance to do so. Alright, let's see. Crafting completed. Back Moth for Drosony. Now? Oh boy. Looks like it's southwest. I'm gonna try to intercept it before it kills this base. The dust storm is now at its peak. We have to wait this out. I had to use a repair pack and three grenades on that. Close to another portal. Save up. All right, I need to do a. Mm. I need to upgrade my HQ with the next attack. Clearing up. Uh, I can see everything again. Let's dust storms help wind but hurt solar. Yeah, soon. and on this map, uh, it's mainly using solar. Something's touching quicksand. There. Whoa! No, 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 no. I was hitting escape just trying to exit the build menu and it, uh... <laughs> I almost, like, reloaded the game. Uh... 
is such an additional expense dealing with the uh, quicksand on this map. Kind of like on the uh, volcano map, you got to deal with all the cooling towers. Do you play with default key bindings, Buck? Uh, yeah, I think so. I've been playing the game for so long, I don't remember changing anything. It's certainly possible that I did. Base is under attack. Uh. Wrong button. An energy connector has been destroyed. Oh my god, I couldn't survive the quicksand for two seconds. Does that fix it? Okay. Carbonium storage is full. Upgrading HQ. As I said. In progress. This will attract a lot of attention. And then we got to figure out which way the next hit's going to come from. As much as we can. Things are going to get very hot very soon. It's called quicksand, not slow sand. <laughs> so stupid. Shut up. We tried punching on this map last time, and I gotta say I hated it. So I'm gonna use this until we hit the crabs or I have to swap to the hammers. And I can drop down a whole bunch of sentinel towers last minute once I figure out where they're coming from. See, it's just so much easier dealing with the mush pits with this. Like, oh my god. Coming from the base. east. They are very close. Prepare yourself, Ashley. We've made all the preparations that we could. Let's go out and meet them. Base is under attack. Up. Oh. Portals has been destroyed. Threat neutralized. This oh, no mush pits. It was just a, it was just a crab rave. Yeah? That's the all HQ it was. Upgrade. It was only crabs. <laughs> Sign up for my own. Crabs. <laughs> that has horrifying implications. Our base is low on power. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't see chat. 
Uh, it was, it did not finish the, the vote was canceled by the base upgrade attack. That was not a stronger attack. Okay, need more ironium. That happens once potentially per survival game that we do. We've been swindled. <sighs> gotcha. Uh, I need more ironium. More. Alright, while I've got excess carbonium, let's up our power grid. Uh, what just happens? I think the power there should come back as soon as those buildings finish. Alright, let's... going to get this area ready for becoming part of the base. Which means getting this goddamn quicksand out of here. So we do have palladium in this area if we need it. the wrong kind of thing. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Let me just waste all this money redoing that. We should get free sales for that. <laughs> okay, Karen. <laughs> yelling at customer Beast service. I want free snail coupons. Like I have suffered emotional trauma. Are originating from a common points near our base. Interesting. Compensation. We should go and investigate that area. What's going on? All right. A Our bad thing is full. happening down here. Build more storage facilities. This looks like a nest of some sort. We should clear it out and reduce the strength of hostile attacks. There is a lot of them inside. This might be difficult. might be difficult. Alright. Com hub. Second armory. I should have done that com hub earlier. Chances of survival. That took me too long. Else. See if we can connect this to the main power grid. Okay, that is connected. Your turn, chat. If you'd like to tamper with the game, you've got an opportunity. Another thing. You did. You guys did a like an thing. Interesting research specimen. We should go to its location and see what we can learn. Uh, 
Oh, there's some Carbonium there, too. Oh, this one's a boss. This creature is extremely hostile. It can be dangerous to our base. Kill it before it kills us. We'll finish researching it in the lab. Threat neutralized. I wonder what made it so aggressive. Probably us being here <laughs> on this planet, <laughs> if I had to guess, Ashley. Okay. All right, so let's see. We've already done that. Still working on that. Let's get more storage. Planning ahead, just making a bunch of ammunition buildings. You look low on resources. Let's shake some into existence. Oh, resource quake? Uh okay. A resource comet. The comet Same will hit the surface. Okay. Soon. So let's see, I got two minutes. Um do artillery and then we have to investigate it. upgrade HQ. Upgrade those. There goes the comets. We should have access to. There we go. Uh, mini miner, cryo, and lightning. Uh, no. Uh... The comet oh, I mean, no, that's ground. not. Ashley, let's go and investigate that area. See that. Comet hit the ground way up there to the northwest. All right. Uh, let's see. While I'm waiting, let's see if there's anything nearby. It's probably outside the wall. Nyavila gifted a tier one sub to strong attack. They have given 539 <laughs> gift subs in the channel. Ironium? Ah, uh, Conscious Canuck and Neov. Thank you for the gifted subs. If you pick something I'm able to do from the console, I will do it. More Palladium. Making sure we've got power coverage around the walls for when I run around making towers shortly. A new technology has been developed. There we go. New blueprints are available for crafting. Sand. Your turn, Shad, if you'd like to tamper with the game, you have a chance. I hate that you're about to do Ion Storm. <laughs> Does uh, that mean yeah, I'm gonna hit quick save now? I'm not gonna be able to run out and uh, try to stop them. The ion storm is disabling our equipment. Are available for construction. Not enough AI cores. Build more AI hubs. 